Okay, we're going to talk about filters and editing properties. The filters and editing properties will work on PCBs and schematics both. Let's take a look here. If I right click on this part, I have an option to say find similar objects. So I open up to find similar objects and I can say, yeah, I want to find everything that has this current footprint. Right, everything that has an axial 0.03. And I'll say apply. And now those two got filtered. Say OK. And now if I come to properties, I see that these guys both have this footprint. I might want to change it. So I can say add. I want to add a footprint. And maybe I'll add a footprint from miscellaneous devices. Maybe I want them to be axial 0.4 and say OK. And OK. I've now changed those. I have it available and I've changed them. If I double click this part, well, let's say first I want to get rid of this filter selection. The way to get rid of it is to hit the schematic filter, leave this part blank, and hit apply. I can also just press the F12 key to get the same place and hit apply. I've now removed the filters. And let me double click here. And I notice my footprint's now an axial 0.4. So this is a way if I want to change a whole bunch of parts at once, I don't have to go through and edit them all one at a time. Let's take a look at our PCB over here. If I look at my text here. I'm going to right click on my text to tell it find similar object. I want to find all this text and anything that's a designator because that's what these things are. They're designators. So I'm going to say find all the designators. I'm going to apply. You see they're all highlighted and say OK. And the property comes out. And I can tell it, here's my text height, it's 60 mils. I'm going to change it to 40 mils. And here's the width of the stroke, right? That's the width of the line in the character. I'm going to change that to 7. And now you notice that all my designators are small again. Let's try that with these here. These are comments. I'm going to right click on this, find similar this text, comment, find all the comments, and apply, and say OK. And my comments, I'm going to make smaller. I'll make those 40 by 7. And now you see my comment here is smaller, and this comment is smaller. So this is a handy way to change things quickly and easily using these filters. Um, and it's another nice tool that's in Altium that will make your life easier as you do your designs. Thanks.